All right, we got the uh, the girls went out and laid down a challenge to the guys, and uh, again, two teams that were probably not projected to win today, but they pulled the upset over uh, the team from over in Rockland County today. So we're going to come in for the names from everybody on the Arlington Admirals, winners of Boys Class A. Jack Palusio, J.B. Ramirez Valencia, Nice Abadar, Brian Palusio, Ethan Green, Chad Canman, Joshua Bangu, Arsenio Nachov. Okay, and we got another face coming in Evan here. Evan Cox. <laughs> Come on, <laughs> fill it up, you know, more family names over. Yeah, okay. I. Uh, you guys, uh, yeah, I, I have a feeling that, um, you know, there was uh, expectations that the Red Raiders uh, had a little bit more of a pack and so forth. So what did you guys do? I mean, Ethan, you know, you went and cruised to, you know, the win. You didn't have to run hard. You knew that, you know, and everything. But it was these, the fourth, who were the fourth and fifth guys today? Okay, were you guys keeping track of the North Rockland yeah. runners uh, so a bit there? In the in the beginning of the race, uh, North Rockland had a pack of four. Without, we had about a pack of five or six, and um, we knew they were there. We both went out conservatively, knowing that the right way to run boat is to bring it home when you're coming down the hill. So we knew that neither of us were really dying at that point. Um, once we got to the top of the hill, we noticed like we were struggling a lot, but so were they because it's the big hill. So on our way down, we realized that was time we really had to kick, and we both delivered um, in what we had to do today. Yeah, I noticed you coming down the hill. You guys suddenly look, wow, Arlington's got a couple of guys. They're ahead of the North Rockland guys. I didn't see it at the finish that way for some reason, but there's a lot of guys coming in, you know, like that. So you guys know this course a little bit, you know, uh, you, probably better than North Rockland does. And yeah, the key always is that first part. You, you know, you want to run it hard, but not too hard, or you're suffering on the way down. So, um... States, uh, you know, you got a course that turned into a mud bath last year. Um, hopefully it won't be that way. Maybe Friday will be nice for one time and it won't turn into a bog the day before. But uh, what are you hoping to do up there, you know, and everything? Just run your best and... Yeah, run my best and um, well, I'm hoping to get top five. The podium. Yeah, at least, top yeah, top five. five. Top five. Hoping to get top five. Top five. Answer. Um, yeah, hoping to top five. As a team, we're hoping to do better than last year. I think we were like sixth or seventh last year, yeah. somewhere around there. Yeah. This year, I think we have a stronger team, stronger group of people. We can do more this year. Yeah. Well, again, you got the pack, you know, which the great Arlington teams of the past always did. You were always up around third or fourth, you know, and everything. Um, challenging up there, you know, and everything. Um, and Ethan, yeah. Uh, Depends, you know. You're you don't look like you're built for the for the mud baths of uh, the the race like last year. Tall, thin guys usually aren't, you know, unless they're smart enough to run in the grass at the side, you know, and everything. But um, you know, you want to be a you know kind of a smaller plug there. But hopefully, you'll get a much better course this year. You'll do great, and uh, section one will be proud. So the Arlington Admirals coming from, you know, kind of their home course here, coming home with the win, and they are going back to States for the umpteenth time. Congrats. Right, thank, you. Thank, you. Thank, you. Thank, you. thank you. Thank you. Thank you.